Oh, I have this BK7M backing module from Roland. And plugged in the back is a WIDI jack. I'm just using the WIDI in, the MIDI in rather, uh, from that. Um, and in the past, I've had this do it yourself FC7 foot pedal. <laughs> Basically, there's seven switches and a wired cable. I decided I wanted to go wireless because over here is my accordion and I've got a Woody Master in the end into the MIDI out that normally drives the uh, BK7M backing module uh, for the accompaniment um, and I wanted I figured well I'll make a foot pedal normally I was using this wired one as I say but I was wanted to get away from having to plug wires in everywhere um, so step one was to find the foot pedal and I came up with this Roland FC100 which isn't MIDI and isn't even wireless um, used an older system but what I did is I ripped out the motherboard which used to sort of live here um, it's basically just a pile of switches on, on circuit boards uh, and I've got a uh, Adafruit 328p microprocessor um, and a WIDI Core X here with a little external antenna and over on this end I've got a little LED board to replace the one that was originally there and the whole thing is powered by a little LiPo battery sitting down the bottom here um, so far it's hanging in there with power we'll see how long it actually lasts that's an experiment at the moment but this whole lot doesn't take any power at all so I'm hoping it's going to last a few hours um, so I've got I can also uh, yeah, excuse me excuse the jumping around in the back here this this socket here goes to the um, this mess of wires goes to the um, USB input on the 328p uh, and it comes out to a little socket on the side here which so I can uh, power it from here so I can actually charge the battery because this 328p will charge the battery when it's got power and it's turned on um, so I can charge the battery up and also program the 328p through here um, so if I do this actually let me just do this first I'll unplug the weedy jack and I'll turn this thing on so I've got two LEDs, you can't really see them, I know the colours don't show very well, but and the blue flashing one is the one from the Wii Core X, and the red one is coming from the CPU, uh, the MPU. Uh, I'm basically monitoring the connection status pin on the Wii Core X, and I've got a red LED because I figure that's easier to see. And if I plug in over here, my Weedy Jack, we should see everything change very quickly. There we go. So I now got a green LED instead of a red one. So that's my pin, and the other one's steady blue. And if I press a button, you can see the blue, hopefully, you can see the blue LED flashing as it transmits MIDI. Um, so I've got all these switches. So basically, what I'm doing on here is I've got the four variation switches the intro and outro and start stop. Um, I've not got any audio on this at the moment, so we'll just get what we've got. Um, can't really show, oh, well, maybe I can. Let's see, this. Let's see if we can do it this way. Um, almost works. <laughs> Let's, uh, I don't know what that. So anyway, uh, if I press button number four is actually very, button three is at variation one. You can see things changing. I press button two, variation three, variation four, variation four there, and then I've got a very pin number two is intro, uh, number seven is outro, um, like that, and then pin one is to start playing. So I can put this on the floor. It's all battery, I mean I don't have to plug anything in, just turn it on and it all connects and I can use my feet this is a could before but it's just a little bit more convenient um, setting it up it also means I'm not limited by a wire, it's just one less wire hanging around 
The next step is to take this volume pedal. Well, actually, not that one because it doesn't work very well with the system. I've got a Yamaha one over there, and add that into this so I can control the volume through MIDI as well. And then the only wires I'll have are from a volume pedal to the foot controller. I call it a rolling foot controller. It's not anymore. It's uh, my foot controller. Um, and that's that. So pretty well pleased with it so far.